I have a Grazley 52-inch mower with a 23-horsepower Kawasaki engine. I have replaced the battery numerous times and once it starts the mower runs about 30 minutes and then dies and the battery is dead, and I have to recharge it to get it started again or there is some kind of kill switch that won't allow it to restart. Hello. It sounds like you have a charging issue. Do you have access to a multimeter or voltage meter so you can run a few simple tests? I have replaced the battery with new batteries several times and used different chargers as well. Does the mower pull power from the battery while running? It quits once it has been running. I had the starter changed out over the winter and this has been happening since. The battery should charge when the motor is running. If it does not, your charging system is not working. Is the starter the charging system? No, that only starts the motor. Do you have a multimeter? If you have a meter, set it to DC volts and connect it to the battery terminals. At idle you should see 12.6 volts. At full throttle you should see 14.5 volts, max. If it isn't charging, you will see the voltage drop instead. Okay, so I can leave the terminals connected to the battery while testing. Yes. There are two parts to the charging system. There is an alternator coil under the flywheel. This produces AC volts and sends that to the regulator which converts it to DC volts and charges the battery, powers the lights, etc. If it is not charging, what needs to be changed on the motor? In most cases, if you have no voltage it is the alternator, or a broken wire from the alternator. If you have too much voltage it is the regulator. Okay, I'll start there, thanks for the help. Check the voltage, then let me know what you find. I can direct you on what to repair once I know what is going on. One more thing, are there any fuses normally coming from the charging system to the battery to look for? I am only an expert on Kawasaki engines not on all the products they are used in. There is no fuse on the engine, but there should be one in the tractor slash mower. In most cases it's near the battery. The ignition and charging systems are separate so having a dead battery shouldn't cause it to stop running, it should only cause it not to start again. Okay thanks again for the advice. Happy to help. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.